This is a recast of the 3500-word piece, Fast AI, Deep Learning for Everyone, from GPT-5. Let's listen in. The article discusses Fast AI, an open source library developed by Jeremy Howard and Rachel Thomas. Its aim is to make the latest research in machine learning and deep learning accessible and practical. It provides a highly efficient interface for Python and draws on the popular PyTorch deep learning library. Fast AI's main aim is to empower individuals and organizations, regardless of their background or experience, to create powerful AI models quickly and with little effort. The idea for Fast AI started back in 2016 when Howard and Thomas founded the Fast AI Research Institute. They wanted to bridge the gap between academic research and artificial intelligence, AI, and practical application, making cutting-edge AI research accessible to a wider public. Fast AI plays a central role in democratizing access to advanced machine learning technologies. It offers an accessible platform that has significantly lowered the barriers to entry in deep learning. Whether you're in academic research, industry, or just a hobbyist, you can use Fast AI to develop innovative solutions for a wide range of problems. One key feature of Fast AI is its easy-to-use API, which allows complex models to be trained and implemented with just a few lines of code. But apart from that, what makes Fast AI stand out is the community that has formed around the project. Think online courses, tutorials, forums. All these support users in troubleshooting and encourage knowledge sharing. Let's discuss some basics of the Fast AI library and its main modules. The vision module is for tasks related to image recognition and processing. The text module focuses on natural language processing and LP tasks. Then you have the tabular module for tasks involving structured data, like predictions from tabular data. And finally, Collab module is designed specifically for recommendation systems. Now let's talk a bit about how you can set up your environment with Fast AI. It is recommended to install Fast AI within a virtual Python environment to prevent conflicts with other libraries. Once installed, you can start importing the Fast AI library into your Python projects quickly and easily. Moving on to how Fast AI is structured, it's designed as a high-level API built on top of PyTorch, one of the leading deep learning libraries. A central element of Fast AI's architecture is the concept of learner objects. A learner in Fast AI encapsulates a model, the data being trained on, and the loss function used. An essential aspect that makes Fast AI powerful is its integration with PyTorch. This close integration allows Fast AI to benefit from the speed, flexibility, and active development community of PyTorch. With PyTorch as its foundation, users can seamlessly switch between PyTorch's low-level API and Fast AI's high-level API. Now, let's look at some examples of real-world applications with Fast AI. These include image recognition tasks like classifying images into different categories, natural language processing tasks such as sentiment analysis of customer reviews, and recommendation systems that generate personalized movie or product recommendations based on users' previous interactions. Despite its user... Even after your models are up and running, Fast AI offers a wide range of tools and techniques for optimizing the training process. These include a learning rate finder, differential learning rates, and an array of callbacks that allow you to monitor and adjust the training process. Lastly, let's touch on the future of Fast AI and machine learning. Fast AI is more than just a library. It's a gateway to the future of machine learning and deep learning. It can play a crucial role in democratizing access to advanced AI technologies by providing tools that are both powerful and user-friendly. That's it for today. 